Picture yourself as a fish in a tranquil pond, existing in a world limited to two dimensions. Oblivious to the three-dimensional sphere above, your life is uncomplicated but confined. Then, you're suddenly hoisted from your aquatic domain, thrust into an unfamiliar dimension of verticality. This newfound reality, where air-breathing humans wander without the aid of fins, is beyond your aquatic understanding. This thought-provoking analogy by theoretical physicist Michio Kaku invites us to question our perception of the universe. Like a fish unaware of the world beyond its pond, our grasp of the universe may be similarly constrained. Kaku suggests that our comprehension of reality might be as limited as that of the fish, confined to the dimensions we know. The concept of hyperspace in physics speaks of higher dimensions beyond the familiar trio of length, width, and height. What if additional dimensions exist, hidden from our senses? These unseen yet essential dimensions mark the beginning of our exploration into the unknown. This quest traces back to the late 19th century with mathematician Hermann Minkowski, a peer of physicist James Clerk Maxwell. Minkowski, inspired by Maxwell's electromagnetic theories, set the stage for understanding the universe's structure, integrating time as an essential element. Albert Einstein, a former student of Minkowski's, added a crucial component to this puzzle in 1905 with his special theory of relativity. Einstein suggested that space and time were interlinked, forming a unified space-time continuum. Minkowski built upon this idea, proposing a four-dimensional space-time model, with time as the fourth dimension. Yet, this four-dimensional framework proved insufficient to fully explain the intricacies of physics. String theory then emerged, postulating that our universe comprises minuscule vibrating strings within ten dimensions, their frequencies shaping the particles and forces observed in our universe. Physicist Edward Witten later introduced an eleventh dimension, hypothesizing the existence of higher dimensional structures known as brainies. Our understanding of the universe evolves with these advancing theories. The additional dimensions may not be menor or concealed, they could be immense, perhaps even boundless. Like insects ensnared on flypaper, our perception is limited, preventing us from interacting with these higher dimensions. The notable weakness of gravity, in contrast to other fundamental forces, may result from its diffusion across these dimensional brains. This theory opens up the possibility of experimentally detecting signs of alternate universes or unseen dark matter entities from other dimensions. Our foray into hyperspace also introduces the idea of multiple team dimensions. Irish engineer and philosopher John William Dunne theory said that a single linear time dimension is inadequate. According to Dunne, extratemporal dimensions are necessary to track our journey through time, leading to an endless cascade of time dimensions and corresponding levels of consciousness, ultimately leading to what Dunne described as a superlative general observer in eternal existence. The notion of multiple time dimensions has the potential to radically alter our understanding of reality, unlocking the doors to dimensions yet to be explored. When contemplating multiple timelines, it's easy to feel overwhelmed. Let's recalibrate our approach by exploring the more concrete and fascinating concept of the twin paradox, enhanced by advanced computational capabilities. Envision Ace and Bob, two genetically identical twins. Ace, the space explorer, embarks on a high-speed cosmic journey, leaving Bob on Earth. Upon his return, Ace is significantly younger than his Earth-bound brother Bob, a direct result of Einstein's theory of relativity, as demonstrated by the twin paradox. Now, let's add an intriguing dimension to this scenario. Imagine that Ace and Bob not only share their genetic makeup, but are also bound by the same destiny. This means any genetic condition affecting Bob will, in time, impact Ace. For example, if Bob develops a particular health condition at a certain age, he could forewarn Ace, allowing Ace to anticipate and prepare for similar health challenges in his future. In this nuanced version of the twin paradox, Bob's normal aging process represents a higher temporal dimension compared to Ace's space-altered timeline. This concept reshapes our understanding of time, causality, and the nature of existence. Moving deeper into our thought experiment, let's use abstract terms, alpha and beta dimensions, and explore even loftier dimensions. 
Consider our 3D existence. Our eyes perceive a 2D representation of the world, which our brain interprets, creating the illusion of depth in a 3D environment. Donald Hoffman, a cognitive scientist, suggests that our perceived reality is essentially a user interface masking a deeper, unseen reality beyond space-time. Now think about beings in a fourth dimension, 4D beings, perceiving their environment in 3D. These beings might process these 3D images in a way that constructs a perception of a four-dimensional world. In higher dimensions, entities gain expanded perspectives and deeper insights into reality. A 4D being could navigate our 3D world, including time, offering a broader view similar to Bob's understanding of Ace's timeline in our twin scenario. These beings might be able to predict and even influence the paths of those in lower dimensions. Are you prepared to elevate your thinking to this advanced level? Let's consider the existence of a beta being who perceives time differently from an alpha entity. Beta beings possess the ability to fast forward or rewind their life events, revisiting moments in a nonlinear fashion, akin to selecting specific scenes in a movie. This idea is visually represented in the Tesseract scene from Interstellar, where Cooper can access any moment in a specific location, navigating the timeline nonlinearly unlike alpha beings who experience time linearly. Next, we explore the gamma dimension, where beings perceive every moment of life simultaneously, providing a panoramic view of the entire timeline. Gamma beings comprehend the sequences of the Biru timeline in their entirety, surpassing the conventional flow of time. In this gamma dimension, life isn't just experienced in sequential moments. It's viewed as an interconnected narrative, this heightened perception allows for an intricate analysis of each moment, shedding light on the depth of emotions and experiences at any point in time. Imagine accessing such a dimension. In the gamma realm, life's journey isn't a series of isolated events, but a comprehensive mosaic, with each moment contributing to a larger, more complex story. Now we can explore the concept of navigating through multiple timelines, starting with the twin paradox as a base. The paradox illustrates Einstein's theory of relativity using identical twins, Ace and Bob. Ace, an astronaut, ages slower than Bob due to his high-speed space travel. The narrative then expands to suggest that Ace and Bob share not only genes, but also destinies, meaning Ace could anticipate and prepare for health issues experienced by Bob. In a point of view of theoretical realms of higher dimensions, starting with the three-dimensional world we perceive and suggesting the existence of fourth-dimensional beings, 4D beings, who perceive in 3D but understand a 4D world. These higher dimensions offer broader perspectives and deeper insights into reality. Now we can introduce alpha and beta dimensions, with beta beings able to experience time non-linearly, similar to scene selection in a movie. This concept is likened to the Tesseract scene in Interstellar. The gamma dimension is then described where beings see all moments of life simultaneously, offering a complete narrative of existence rather than isolated events. The delta dimension represents a realm where all potential paths and outcomes are visible, allowing for complete awareness and strategic decision-making. This is compared to Doctor Strange's ability in Avengers Infinity War to view multiple outcomes of a situation. Finally, we delves into the epsilon dimension influenced by chaos theory, where slight changes in initial conditions lead to vastly different outcomes. This dimension allows beings to explore alternate realities based on different starting points, offering an exploration of a vast array of alternate lives. Overall, we take you from the twin paradox to a complex discussion of higher dimensions and the potential for different perceptions and interactions with time and reality. Each dimension represents a deeper understanding of the tapestry of life with the potential to explore and experience a multitude of alternate realities. Set forth on an odyssey into the Lambda dimension, progressing from the Epsilon stage. Lambda embodies a domain where each alternate starting condition resembles a unique page in a vast book, every page depicting a different reality born from distinct beginnings. Inhabitants of Lambda possess the ability to perceive not merely a single page but the entire volume of these diverse realities at once, resembling a vast archive of origins and their ensuing journeys. In the realm of Lambda, 
beings act as maestros of a cosmic play, selecting the most advantageous path from a plethora of potential outcomes. This extraordinary capability allows them to pinpoint the most promising business strategies or personal life trajectories, such as choosing to be born to different parents or in another time period. They deftly steer through the labyrinth of possibilities with exactitude, pinpointing the most favorable future. This idea is reflected in the film Mr. Nobody, where the lead character, Nemo, experiences multiple timelines based on pivotal decisions, epitomizing Lambda's skill in traversing varied life paths. Yet, the journey extends further into the Sigma dimension, challenging the steadfastness of our physical laws. Sigma envisions a universe where the laws of physics are not constants but variables, a place where causes may follow effects, time flows erratically, or gravity pushes rather than pulls. This dimension opens the door to realities where the aging process could be reversed or time operates uniquely, as depicted in the film Tenet. Ultimately, we ascend to the Omega level, the zenith of our dimensional exploration. Omega is a realm where limitless realities coexist, each governed by its own set of physical laws. In this dimension, the concept of the impossible is nullified, as beings here have the power to forge new realities, games, and existential frameworks. Omega dwellers might have the capacity to orchestrate events across all these dimensions, an understanding that transcends our limited three-dimensional grasp. As we culminate this voyage of discovery, we're prompted to ponder over the myriad universes and their distinct laws. Who or what could have established these parameters? Our pursuit of knowledge propels us towards greater consciousness, expanding the horizons of our existence. This quest for comprehension enriches our human experience, imbuing our existence with deeper significance as we relentlessly pursue exploration and growth.